Prayers Against the Seven Deadly Sins, taken from St. Gregory's Prayer Book. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. First Prayer Against Anger O meek Savior, Thou Prince of Peace, who, being reviled, reviled not again, and as Thou wast nailed to the cross, didst pray for Thy murderers. Implant in us the virtues of gentleness and patience, that curbing the fury of anger and restraining all resentment and impatience, we may overcome evil with good, continually seeking thy peace and evermore rejoice in thy love, as becometh the children of our Heavenly Father. Amen. Second Prayer Against Pride Lord Christ, thou pattern of humility, who in thine incarnation didst empty thyself of thy glory, taking the form of a servant. Root out of us all pride and arrogance, that owning our weakness and the guilt of our sins, we may bear mockery and contempt for thy sake, esteeming ourselves lowly in thy sight. Help us in these our endeavors for thy loving mercy's sake. Amen. Third prayer against gluttony. O Lord Jesus Christ, who by word and example didst teach us the virtue of abstinence, grant that serving thee and not our own appetites, we may live soberly and with contentment, avoiding inordinate love of food and drink, restraining our appetites in all things, that thy will, being above all else our food and drink, we may continually hunger and thirst after thy righteousness. Amen. Fourth prayer against lust. O Lord Jesus Christ, thou lover of purity, who was pleased to take upon thee our nature and to be born of a pure virgin, look upon our infirmities. Make in us clean hearts, renew a right spirit within us. Help us to drive away evil thoughts and conquer every sinful desire, and so pierce our flesh with thy fear, that we may serve thee with chaste bodies and please thee with pure minds. Amen. Fifth prayer against covetousness. O Lord, who though rich for our sakes became poor, grant that all eagerness and covetousness of earthly goods may die in us, and the desire of heavenly things may live and grow in us. Grant us willingness to give as we are able to him that needeth for thy sake, who gave us thine own life, that we may inherit thy heavenly treasures. Amen. Sixth prayer against envy. Most loving Lord Christ, pattern of charity, grant us so to love thee with all our heart and mind and soul and our neighbor, for thy sake, that the grace of charity and brotherly love may dwell in us, and all envy and ill will die in us. Fill our hearts with love and compassion, that we may both rejoice in others' happiness and lament their adversities, thus following thee, who art thyself true and perfect love. Amen. Seventh prayer against sloth. Lord Christ, who in the garden didst pray so long and fervently that thy sweat was, as it were, great drops of blood falling to the ground. Put away from us all sloth, both of mind and body. Kindle in us the fire of thy love. Strengthen our weakness, that whatsoever our hand findeth to do, we may do it with all our might. Amen. Lord, have mercy upon us. Christ, have mercy upon us. Lord, have mercy upon us. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen.